Let's simplify the fraction 13 fifths. And here's how we do that. What we want to do is find another fraction that's equal to, it's equivalent to 13 over 5, has the same value, just that we've simplified or reduced it to lowest terms. What we need to do is find a common factor. So the only thing that goes into 13 and 5 evenly, that's 1. And if I divide 13 by 1, I get 13. If I divide 5 by 1, I get 5. So it doesn't change. This is what we started with. What that means is that this is already in lowest terms. We can't simplify this any further. The only thing we could do is change it to a mixed number. Let's do that. So 5 goes into 13 two times, because 2 times 5 is 10, and then we'd have 3 left over. Just bring the denominator across. And 13 fifths, this improper fraction, does equal the mixed number 2 and 3 fifths. But back to our original question, the fraction 13 over 5, 13 fifths, we can't reduce this any further. So this is actually simplified. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.